Look at the Sako Ekomedem, the Marianta them, the Christopher Anu them, or maybe those ones them are just wickedness in the blindfolder. They don't finally see say, this anglophone agitation that a source of income, revenue, it makes them relevant, they raise money out of it. So they no one for leave them. It's their cash cow. They could try for make as much money as possible while with the agitation is still go on, I guess. But any person where it get two eye brain cells, it go don't realize what you have start tell them since 2018. Everything where they talk today, they are disunity, they are infighting, the facts the international community you know they come, they, they arrest them, lock them for, for Europe, for America, for Nigeria, and everywhere else. All of those things, I said it. I don't tell them since 2018. As a matter of fact, I don't predict the end of ambassador terrorism. Say it ended for 2019. When I go back for YouTube, the videos the day for day, I predicted the end of ambassador terrorism. It ended in 2019. Everything will happen after that, not just an obituary, a very long, slow process for the obituary. Fellow Amazonians, at this stage, I'm very, very weak. Because I believe the struggle is already ending. And if you say the struggle is already ending, we have to tender an apology letter to Mr. Paul Beer. And that is the struggle right now. We are useless and we are hopeless if we don't take an action. Our women and children are becoming very, very angry with us that we cannot protect them. That is the reality. My country people then, today I want to make prediction. And my prediction I say the end of this Ambazonia armed insurrection will be February 2019. Wanna listen? Oh, I don't know you, they see these killings when they depend somebody over. What do bloggers really tell you guys when they come online and spend three hours? What do they really? Because I've never had the time to really sit and watch. What do they tell you guys? Now, oh no, we should make a count a tax system. We should start taxing colonial tax because now we have to pay taxes. Is that what they tell you? Is that what they tell you? Oh, we should form government. Oh, and no, a government is good, yeah? Because we have to govern ourselves. Is that what they tell you? You have not even defeated the toe of the enemy you want to govern your leg. You cannot. This is stupid. You have arrested citizens, arrested your own, kidnapped your own citizens, chopped off their own fingers. You have kidnapped generals. They are coming to fight you. They are not going anywhere. They are coming to fight you and take pictures, slaughtering you guys and piling you up like dirt. We've seen photos from Manfe where boys are being killed and piled like dirt one above the other. Horrible, gory, horrific photos. And you're here saying, Oh, don't take the war into Land Republic. Don't take the war into. Are you stupid? So, we have a lot on our hands. As I'm coming live, I've seen some corpses in Bamenda death. Every day, they kill our Amber boys. And let us record that each day, we have at least 10 deaths each day. Know that that each day in Ground Zero, we have at least 10. And we cannot be losing people. At this rate and we think that we will win no we are not in essence winning that's the truth we are not as a winning we're gonna be losing people each day and we think that we win when i remember I said there are different stages of grief and loss when person lost something where he value him, like a dear family member or a failed so-called revolution there are stages where the person they go through the first stage in a denial that they feel shocked disbelief panic confusion so they would deny say the person never actually died they would deny say the thing it not actually happen the next one it could be na anger they could be very angry they could blame themselves they could try to blame others they could blame objects they could look for any person for blame them they could be bitter and resentful after that they would enter the phase of bargaining where they would start to feel some kind of guilt they would start to talk say if only i had done this if only i had done more all of those things are not just the third phase of grief. And then the next phase, not depression. They will enter in a state of de depression where they will feel tired, hopeless, helpless, isolated. And then, finally, finally, acceptance. You will accept the truth. Say so you don't lose that thing or you don't lose the person 
and you'll be ready enough for move forward. Now the last and final stage of grief and loss. And Barcelona terrorists them too, they go through all those five stages then. Some of them, they go arrive at those different stages then, at different times. When we now see cuckoo that beans them, we now see the other ones where they don't run come out, the sperm chop nan chop them. We now see the scam and come out, the nan bere, the ones where they surrender. We now see the Paul Nilong them. We now see the Capo Daniel, the way they come preaching at one Cameroon today. All of them arrive at different stages of grief at different times. When they see, when when I hear Amber Fools, they talk about Canada dialogue, Canada negotiations, uh, uh, Canada pre talks, Swiss negotiations. All of those now stages of they go start by denying it. Now remember for 2018-19, Anglophones they talk say we are gone, we are gone, we know one way nothing, we know one dialogue, we know one nothing, we know one. Later on they start talking about it. We must. Dialogue, we must solve this problem not only for the negotiating table. But that's not what they said in 2018-19. When I remember say, so these ones that not just signs for tell when I say they don't lose something where they behold them dear to them. For the few ones where they actually believe in this nonsense. And it would take them different stages. Maybe if it take them three, four years for process through all of these stages, denial, anger, bargaining depression finally finally they go accept the reality and the day where they accept reality say their own losses they go adjust maybe they go surrender they go abandon the nonsense go start in mind their business like eric tato don't do them or they go kind of beg for negotiation they go kind of beg for forgiveness they go kind of find way for enter back inside cameroon for for try for make amends those are all the five stages of grief my country people